I know that this is all old stuff and I don't know why I keep circling back. I cannot, every time y'all play a video, I keep now focusing on Maurice Hill and the way he's walking. And the way he's walking. And I'm pretty sure this is already something that people may know. I already said that I believe, um, not allegedly, let me go. I already was saying how Maurice Hill, that they're, that the cousin nephew Hill, I said it in my previous videos, I said how um, the twins was calling the BM allegedly God sister. I said all that. But I keep seeing distantly because I got Kia Moore in the distance from this family and I got Gotti in the distance not from this family but from Maurice Hill for some reason and I can't even make it seem like I just have this bunch of information flowing out I will actually have to clarify or I want to clarify what the actual connection may be because all I keep getting is, is is him walking like with this slow walk like this slow walk, but the way he's looking around, it feels like success. It feels like, um, it more so just feels like success. It feels like, um, I can't des describe what I'm actually trying to say. When I seen him walking around and every time, but when I seen it this time, when I, it's the it's like he's browsing around the scene to make sure everything's in place. But also, it's like he's browsing around the scene, but all these phones out, it feels like he's actually also also it feels like he's also um trying to make sure that he's being witnessed like the cameras on on scene and stuff i know that's all orchestrated i know the gathering of people all being over there with their cameras i know the loud commentary that's all orchestrated i don't care the posting it online there's no discretion here it's all orchestrated but i feel like he has to be in view of being on scene to guarantee he's paid the job the job let's just um it'll be really briefly because i don't know why i'm seeing that but i just want to make it real clear and i know the people hate the cards but huh, you dick eaters gotta stay off my page it says tarot of the high priestess i do tarot so if you don't want to if you don't like tarot you don't believe in it if you feel like you can debunk the cards do what you actually have to do but this is what i'm going to do on this platform i really feel like um it's becoming a full-time job now to stop myself or refrain myself from saying some some awful shit to some people but the thing about it is though if you don't believe anything if you feel like this is right i understand like let Dolph rest and you know like respect his family first and foremost no disrespect no disrespect i respect Dolph. so until y'all motherfuckers get on here and fucking start making sense and stop sounding like zombies drake said it best niggas with no money act like money isn't everything we can't relate to the pedigree a lot of us can't relate i can't so I think a lot of you can't relate neither if you really think for a second that family or that brother brother shit really matter because it really don't. But anywho, I just want to see Maurice Hill show me show me the 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 energy. It's the the it's the posture, the body language that I was getting energy from. It's not his presence alone because as you see I haven't actually said anything about him. It's it's him by himself. It's not the mother, it's him by himself. Unk. 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 Let me see about let me see let me see 
he was at Makita's. He owns Makita's. We know that. But let's see why he's here. Let me see what the energy was about. The Page of Wands. This is a messenger. This is a messenger. The Chief Falconer is on the card. So you were a chief on this scene. Everybody has their own little vital role. You got somebody that's over the crash dummies. You got somebody that's over the real hitters. You got somebody that's orchestrating and making sure the location is set in place the way that it was supposed to be. And then you also have people that's in place to make sure that they spread the word. The page of stakes, although he is the chief, he doesn't play no vital role. It doesn't feel like he actually was to pull the trigger or anything like that. Um, it feels like location. He plays, it feels like location and it also feels like he's making sure the message is sent. That's all I'm seeing. He's making sure the message is sent. The nine of cups is here. So there's fellowship that comes, um, celebrating the victories. There was fellowship to come in regard to this. And then you got the Ten of Swords again. So the two people that was in there, no matter how y'all look at it, I'm sorry to say, I do not, I do not get the energy. And I, I've been trying to go back and forth of it. I'm trying to figure it out because a part of me, I do feel like, but I do not get him actually being killed in that location. I just have him being in that location. It's very, very, very weird. I do not know. But the thing about it is, though, is when I'm looking at... I got to show you this page of swords. And I got to show you how the body is in reverse. I got to show you how the knife is going between uh the that that middle area like being um castrated i have to show you how these two these people are aligning and and it's with rope and for some reason i feel like um it feels like being carried i'm sorry it just does it just does it just does all for this king of cups who's very passionate about his about his um his position so I'm just going to ask one more question and then I, that's going to be it. Like I said, I do believe that Maurice Hill was in the parking lot walking away, the walking how he was based on him having to be short. I give you one job, my dude, and you, your only responsibility is to make sure that the scene is in place. You don't got to worry about nothing. Make sure the, the location is correct. Make sure the scene is, is in place. It feels like that. It feels like that. It also just made sure it's like this is your responsibility. Everybody was given. And it feels like he was walking around like the man because it's like mission accomplished. But also it's like these are one of his accomplishments. And I feel like you just randomly put in. Not randomly. I just feel like you just put in work for um, for hood niggas. Remember I said these are family. These, this is a family function. Uh, feel like family members that know hood niggas. That's what I feel. That's what it feels like. So I feel like you think you're getting your stripes, but you're not getting those stripes. You you didn't do shit. But but let niggas use your location. You didn't do shit. The thing about it is though, is I feel like um the ten of swords is coming up again with the page of swords now. And then you got the justice card. I'm not going to give y'all the prediction, but the star comes out on top regardless. The real card is in the reverse. The star comes out on top regardless. I told y'all a long time ago that you really should find shelter because it's about to rain. I kind of feel that way. And that's all alleged. Everything I'm saying is alleged. I don't even know if this is true or correct. It's like, if God put it out there, he puts it out there. I told y'all that it was somebody that called that tip line the same day that shit popped off. I told you about that, right? And I really want you to sit back and hear me when I say that it's going to rain, okay?
You know why? Something about an eldest son. Something about the eldest son. The eldest son. Why not? Why not just say allegedly? The eldest son wants out of this fiasco. The eldest son wants out of this fiasco. He wants no part with this fiasco. You know the hierophant. You know that higher enlightenment. You know once they start seeing that he don't want no parts of this. He is internal. It's being kept on the low. But they're going to have to do what they got to do for in regard to this hidden treasure. Because some sort of truth will be released out. Some sort of truth. And they don't want that truth to come out. They don't want that truth to come out. Because I understand. Yeah. I'm going to leave it at that though. I'm going to leave it at that. I definitely say that you... Uh, Made sense why um why niggas is not trying to really say nothing they didn't have their stories correct no none of that but i remember the first time i ever heard what marie saying when he was like i thought he shot up the place because you was basically trying to say you wasn't saying that the other dude in there shot up the place you were saying that i thought Dolph shot up the place i thought th i thought somebody shot the place up but it's not making any sense what you actually said. See, I think with the Ace of, Ace of Wands here, I think you was given exactly what to say and you fucked up your wording. I honestly do. Because you did not mean to say, I didn't even see a body. I don't think you meant to say that. I think you were supposed to say that I thought he shot up the place. It was this person in here. I thought he shot up the place. Because uh, uh, y'all were trying to make it seem like Dolph got killed during a during the commission of committing a crime whatever that may be and i know y'all wanted to say no but the thing about it is what maurice hill said and what pamela hill said is two different things one person is talking about a purchase and the other person is talking about i didn't know what was going on because i just thought he shot up the place you lead somebody to actual, well, why would you presume such a thing? Is it because he's in here dead or is it because his shots? If you don't see him on the ground, you don't see his car. How is there a presumption that this dude or whoever, whoever was in here with Dolph, whatever, I thought they shot up the place. You didn't say that you thought the kill. You said, I thought they shot up the place. I thought he shot up the place. Because you was trying to fucking paint the picture that Dolph is a fucking a menace. That he be out here, y'all got him fucked up. I don't care what he was talking about on them goddamn tracks. I don't care what he was talking about. Y'all niggas are fucking rats. Y'all are hood boogers. I don't care what Dolph was talking about on them tracks. That nigga was not talking to, was, ain't nobody trying to hear that gun sound all day long. Not when I'm really out here trying to raise a king and I got a little girl. Not when I'm out here portraying family. Not when I'm out here portraying family men. I don't care what he was talking about in the trash. That shit's null and void. That shit's null and void. Okay? Period. All that side out of sight, out of mind. That's why he was really trying to put it out there. Like, no one gives a fuck. No one's really beefing with niggas. Da -da -da -da. After the whole situation that happened with Gotti. Now, you could say, like, oh, well, he was still mentioning Gotti. Listen. Trust me. When I say feeling, I feel allegedly that he was trying to change the subject. Number one is old. Number two, you didn't already did what you wanted to do. That's the reason why the Seven of Cups is coming out right here on top. Because this whole idea of basically starving niggas is how they fucking feel. This two of coins here that basically Dolph and his partner pretty much could have just been sharing the riches among themselves. It's a hierarchy here. And I don't know. It's either a situation of with the two of coins, two people trying to get this money here. And then you got a knight of cups, which I am going to allege that as someone else. Well, it says the brother right here.
the beggar's feast. You guys weren't happy. It don't matter. That's why the strip card is coming in right now. And on the strip card, it actually says your whole being belongs to hell. And I don't know why it's saying that, but it does. I don't know why. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to make it more clear, but I'm not. I got the King of Wands here. I'm trying to make it more clear. Um, I'm trying to understand because I don't want to seem like I'm, you know. I'm trying to be clear here. Like, let's, let's just try to get a better idea. But I just, the people is going in fucking circles. And I'm just, I'm to the point where I'm just like, he like, yo, it's just so much to catch up. It's just so much catching up. I'm like, yo, do you really think doing the videos is actually getting somewhere? Like the people haven't even seen you walk in the establishment. Get out the car. We are still stuck there. We still stuck there. Yes, we might see that the footage is doctor. Yes, we might see that the footage is old. They still trying to place you walking through the fucking doors. What are you going to do? What should we do? He said, how do motherfuckers play catch up by themselves? Niggas going to have to go back to the very beginning. The very beginning when I've been talking about me and Jay. See, I know y'all sitting back. But like I said, niggas with no money act like money isn't everything. I, I don't got time for y'all. Eight of stakes is here. Eight of wands is here. Same same cards, same cards. The three of coins in regard to partnership. This card is very, 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 very interesting. Because this card is giving me... I know somebody put in uh, the comments one time and said Daddy O. I believe Daddy O and Dolph really are heavy on the partnership here. Um, cause I wasn't, that wasn't the person that I was, I was getting energy from. Although he is a little kind of sort of looks stocky, chubby, whatever. I was getting somebody else I think was a little chubby. I don't know why I think I was, but the nine of stakes is here. The fool is here and the five of coins. One more time. Let's just see about this. Let's see about this. Um, this Mr. Hill. I still have you celebrating the victory of the op. I don't know why. I do. I have you celebrating the victory of the op. I have the beggar's feast. Four of cups. The beggar's feast. I have the king of swords. I got a proposition for you. Because you know what it is. Oh, not the narrow escape. Not the narrow escape coming up for the seven of swords. Not the narrow escape. It literally says narrow escape here. It says narrow escape. I know for a fact I was talking about that motherfucking door. I know for a fact I was talking about that door, how niggas was going out that door that y'all trying to say, no, they're not. Uh, no, it doesn't exist. Uh, no, it does Shut the fuck up. It's just, I'm sorry. And I know it's not everybody. It's very frustrating. I don't even know him. And I found myself grieving this morning. Because this shit is scary. This shit is scary that People could sit back and go through, people could get killed in the streets in their own city. And the people would try to put it together. And it's like, what happens when you got the city, when you got, when it's levels to the shit? What happens? The road card is here. This cycle is over. But the thing about it is, though, I'm telling you, this deed doesn't go unpunished. Because what happens when, listen, he said, listen, your faith has healed you go in peace you've been free from this suffering i'm telling you this deed will not go unpunished you had somebody that was praying repenting before they were taken it's not going to go unpunished it's not going to go unpunished but it comes back up i'm in it here it comes back up mr hill allegedly you of being the page of stakes now, this is the Dracula Tarot. So I want you to understand that a stake is how you necessarily kill a vampire. You stick it through their heart. That's what they say. But in this, this here is actually the Page of Wands. 
whoever idea this was you had one fucking job they made you feel like a big man by sip by deeming you the chief of this or deeming you the chief of this here play everybody we going we got listen we got a supervisor on every post Key Glock gonna pay gonna be a supervisor at the video. I don't care what the fuck y'all talking about. You're gonna be the supervisor here at the cookie shop. Y'all crazy as hell. Y'all crazy as hell. That's y'all motherfucking problem now. That's y'all problem now. Thinking that motherfuckers cannot get rocked to sleep. That's your problem now. Believe everything. Believe everything that somebody say. Everything. It does not matter. It doesn't matter what Dolph put out right in front of you. It does not matter. You believe any fucking thing. This is weird. This is crazy. And I hate to vent. The sun comes out again. The sun symbolizes the Leo in tarot. But it also is a good card. It's a good card. It's a good card because whatever is being hidden is coming out. It's coming out. And I don't mean no harm to nobody. The fucking moon is here. These illusions are coming out. They're coming out. You got the nine and the eight. You get the 17. You get the 17. You get the star. You get the seven of swords. It just shouldn't be that way. But it does not matter. Judgment comes. I promise you. This depiction has been Vlad this whole time. Where Vlad is actually that of. He is coming off as Dolph here in this depiction. It does not matter. It does not matter. It does not matter. I told you before and I promise it's alleged until God himself proves it as true and correct. I'm telling you now that it's going to rain. It's been raining and it's going to continue to rain. The judgment is here. The judgment is here. But I just wanted to put this out here because honestly speaking, the eight of swords is in reverse. Vlad's father and brother are murdered. That's what the cards say. The three of swords is here. The three of swords is here. The three of you. I'm done though. And I really want, I got the justice here. I got the six of coins. I got the four of coins. I need y'all to understand there is no fucking, there is nothing. There's nothing here but love. You would not understand it. It's nothing here but love. I understand y'all want to let Dolph family get some peace. I want Dolph family to get some peace. I'm forever praying for Dolph family, but let me get it understand. We fucking make the enemy perish. We make the enemy our footstool. So I don't got them kind, sweet words for the people that I'm talking about. I don't give a fuck. I need you to respectfully understand my stance. Don't think for a second I'm just on here ranting about Dolph. I don't sit back and I don't bring up Vaughn. I don't. But let me tell you, if you want to talk about other people that make that make a difference in this world too, we could. We could. But this right here is is what's being illuminated. This right here. This right here. Because you will not perish. You will have everlasting life. This is why I'm here. So, I'm telling you, don't make me feel some type of way when I'm coming up here speaking my passion. Don't do it to me. Because even though I'm not in fucking Memphis, even though I'm not in Memphis, I see who the ops is. And the things that I'm saying to you, I'm saying to you so you can later on see it as true and correct if God allows that to take place. 
but please chill the fuck out for the folks that think they want to challenge me not in them comments i'm talking about this is going to be um a telepathic message for you i need you to not try to challenge me don't challenge me because i told you before and i'll tell you again it will rain it does not matter and when you try to tussle with me i don't give a fuck about your life i'm coming for the purest one so please 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 don't do it and i'm only saying that because i'm tired of fucking being targeted i'm tired of being targeted i'm tired of being targeted okay I ain't gonna I ain't gonna say too much on here, but I'm telling you. Dolph know I adore him to death, but I'm telling you, if you want fucking smoke, I'm telling you, I I can guarantee you these results. Don't come on here while I'm speaking my passion, please and thank you. You don't understand it. You wanna let Dolph rest. I don't see y'all motherfuckers in here trying to figure anything out. Yeah, I sat back and wanna well key glock is his cousin. Like I said, niggas with no money at like money isn't fucking everything. Y'all sat back and really try to make an excuse for that nigga busting out that 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 boy windows when in true reality I just told you on the other video that it ain't y'all motherfucking business what they go through. Dolph will never let y'all see him beefing with his family. Never let y'all see him beefing with his team. Never never so understand when that nigga put out loud that he was fucking Gotti bm he gained some ops he did it was bigger than motherfucking Gotti. because i know you ain't telling it it's been bigger than this you better go back niggas got killed in 2020 Niggas got killed in 2020. Niggas got GoFundMe's. How you get? How you cooking that crack like that? Whatever. Tennisor is here. I ain't gonna say nothing. I ain't gonna go back and forth. All I know is, I said what the fuck I said, and um, and that's it. I'm not gonna make it a rant. I just wanted to come on here because I think we needed to get some things misconstrued. It's not fair to me. It's not fair to me at all. I'm a regular ass reader. You ain't saying nothing about them bloggers who is dead on y'all asses. It's not my fault that, listen, I ain't even gonna say nothing. This is probably gonna be my last video, but you've seen the cards that I show you. The Tinosaurus keep on showing. You've seen the cards here, right? I'm letting you know this deed shall not go unpunished. I'm letting you know right now. I'm just reading the Eight of Coins. We got the high priestess. The high priestess in this deck was Vlad's um, princess. But we were just here to talk about the page of states. We were just here to talk about this chief who I identified as Maurice Hill allegedly. That's all. That's all. Somebody else on Gotti's side? Somebody else? What? We? Somebody else? Y'all about to be. I'm from the streets. You gotta pay with your life. I did, the fuck is y'all talking about? Y'all, what y'all talking about? Hey, you better get out of here with all that brother, brother shit. That's why y'all sitting there looking fucking stupid as hell. I'm sitting in, I'm sitting in the motherfucking. I'm sitting at the motherfucking club. I can't even fucking enjoy myself the right way because I know that this nigga right here that I'm listening to right here, man, I know this nigga, uh, this nigga that I'm listening to right here, not Dolph, the nigga that I hear on the radio, I know this nigga that I'm listening to right here that is sitting in the music industry. I know this nigga got his, I know this nigga be sitting in a fucking 
unmarked car behind tents, drinking fucking champagne, looking icy on the scene, on the scene of niggas getting killed. He's watching niggas die. Y'all don't even know. We ain't even talking about Duffy and talking about God. Y'all don't even know. Y'all have no idea, but it's okay. Cause like I told you before, niggas with no money act like money isn't everything. And that shit just won't get out of my head. I got PTSD, okay? I just want to come to y'all and bring it to y'all. Like I told you, the moment I channel something, I listen, I was, I'm trying to roll some goddamn weed. I'm trying to roll some goddamn weed. I ain't trying to sit here and aggravate y'all about dog, but let me tell you, God got his hand on me and I know for a fact, I know for a fact, this deed will not go unpunished. I tell you for a fact. Now, I told you that niggas need to get in that goddamn house. Get in that house because it's going to rain. I'm telling you that right now. But you don't got to believe me no more. But I want the fucking people that's being simple on this internet. I want y'all to stop. That is the, you are the reason why they keep on sweeping shit underneath the rug. Because you fucking think everybody is fucking loyal. I need y'all dumb bitches to log off. I need y'all to. I need you to. I need you to. Bad. I need you to. You are fucking up the case. I need you to. You don't understand that all we got to see is that the public, a great percentage of the public, truly think it was some street shit. Ain't nobody going to solve no street shit. Y'all back, y'all sitting back, shit, we fucking, we, we talking about put a date on it. We talking about put a date on it from 2000 and motherfucking 19, two years ago. You mean to tell me that a motherfucker might think that they ain't have nothing to do with it just to be talking? Come on, stop with that fanned out shit. Stop with that fanned out shit. This shit is real. This shit ain't like fucking Vaughn. I see what y'all saying. I love Vaughn to death. But the thing about Vaughn is a little different. This right here. This won't see. You want to know why you won't really see no work getting put in for Vaughn? You really want to know? Because. Let me take that off. Strike that. You want to see why. You want to understand why niggas is going to be shit. Y'all want to understand why shit is fucking getting hectic in Memphis. Somebody. Listen. Jesus himself is part in the sea in Memphis. I listen, I was getting Houston three days after Dolph died. Jesus is part in the sea somewhere in Texas. I'm telling you, that's what I was getting allegedly. I don't got no cards in front of me. That's what I was getting allegedly. Now, I told you before that your ass was being watched. Like, yeah, we know the feds is watching. But your ass is being watched. I even want to fucking give a shout out to the other motherfuckers that 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 think they that think they riding for Dolph. You being watched. I want to let you know that. Cause the thing about it is, we don't give a fuck about them crocodile tears. God seen what was going on, and when it comes to one of his, one of his very own, he will allow. The enemy, he will harden the heart of the enemy to attack Dolph just to come back in to show you who really God is. That's why I love him. He's so mighty. And he's uh, he's a fear of God. I love him. I love him. So I'm telling you now, I'll leave it here. But we got to go back to what he... I'm not here to prove anything. I'm not here to prove anything. I told you before, it's more so for clarity, no confusion. Now, I'm sorry that I came on here talking more shit than anything. I wasn't this way with Vaughn too much. I don't know why. But with Dolph, I don't even, I didn't even listen to his music. I didn't listen to Vaughn music neither. But with Dolph, I feel like y'all took my brother. I feel like y'all took my brother. And on top of y'all taking my brother, y'all literally, it's so weird. Y'all literally are fellowshipping and fake mourning. And this shit is rubbing me. This shit rubbing me the wrong way. It's getting to me. But I understand God is truly in control. I just want 
the internet especially youtube youtube is such a vital source i just want us to not be so quick to dismiss real shit i had no idea that there was a creation of dumb and dumber out of this whole time it's so important to pay attention because you're fucking the enemy be so close to you niggas got ops ain't no way Dolph will be in with the position he would if y'all was if Dolph had somebody following him to make sure that if anybody was to try to hop on timing y'all was gonna be busting niggas heads clean off in the car behind y'all got that thing and y'all going y'all letting it off how does happen how do they got pictures following Dolph by yourself like why are y'all saying this like y'all don't have no real hatred this is sick because y'all don't even i can't even go back and forth because y'all still think that motherfucking memphis ain't fucking give the drop did not particularly point mlk out they don't even take a motherfucking resident of memphis to understand that JFK gets his head blown off from the highest distance for sniper style. And y'all really don't think that no one will be able to be in that position of power, of leverage, unless somebody of power and leverage put them in that position. I just feel like it's very scary being in America because everybody think they say live by the gun, die by the, and that's fucked up. That's fucked up. Dolph ain't dying during the commission of a crime being committed. So why the fuck niggas is just looking at this shit like it's some street shit is really beyond me. Yeah, you got beef, but I'm not about to go out and get slaughtered in my city when I just was getting shot out, shot at out of the fucking state. How? Why now? Why today? I just want us, even if we're not thinking about it, I think you want to talk about respecting this family? The, let's stop dismissing some fucking dismissing the clearest claim dismissing the clearest claim and everybody that i didn't mention it is a alleged but i'm sorry i'm sorry suck my dick i damn near i i listen i don't need no cards i don't need no cards i ain't gonna say nothing that i don't have control of me i'm not gonna say nothing that i'm not I'm empathetic, so I will be able to feel y'all emotions. I can feel y'all, and I can understand when a bitch is is damn near trying to recite the same speech that Lauren London. I can hear that. So, bitch, listen. Go ahead, else with that extra boohoo shit. Y'all fucking fall for anything. Y'all fall for anything. Y'all fall for anything. So, but we're going to keep on pushing. God is good. God is great. We're going to keep on pushing, Dolph. You you know that. We're going to keep pushing. We don't give a fuck about these morons. You think I give a fuck? You know I don't give a fuck. Nigga, I ain't getting paid for this shit. Niggas could fucking hurt me right now looking for me. I ain't getting paid for this shit. Motherfuckers talking about they know where I'm at. I, I ain't getting paid for this shit. So when I tell you I'm war ready, come with it. Because I'm telling you, while you sitting back on my dick, I'm going to be trying to hit the purest one. Please. I'm, I'm telling you now. And I'm on that timing. Because fuck y'all. Y'all are ops. Y'all ops. I'm saying this for the folks that know who I'm talking to. Y'all ops. Y'all ops. And I, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And because y'all may not go to jail, because people that really don't play a significant role may go to jail, listen, man, it's going to rain. I ain't even worried about it. I didn't already seen it. I didn't already seen it. I didn't already seen it. It's going to rain, dog. It's going to rain. Should I pull some cards to show you how it's going to rain?
Let's see how it's gonna rain. It's going to fucking rain. I hope you fucking, you bummy ass niggas get what the fuck you was looking for. It's unfortunate that this too have to occur. But it looks like it's going to happen. It looks like it's going to happen. I'm done. I won't say nothing else. I'm about to go smoke. I'm sorry. I'm freezing cold right now. And I do apologize to any of my subscribers, anybody that watched me who I offended because you're not used to seeing me this way. I really, really, really do apologize. I'm not directing nothing to you at all. I'm not, I'm not directing this. Like, I want you to understand this is for the critics, not for the people that support me, not for the people that see my heart, not for the people that see my passion i'm not coming on here and hey let's see what's going on with the i'm not i'm not a fanned out bitch i ain't making my page just talking and just showing and talking about yeah you killed it and not giving y'all the proof and the pudding i ain't no fanned out bitch so i'm sorry i'm sorry and if and, and i'm sorry if i'm offending people because you just feel like this is not true or you feel like this this goes against this is contrary to your belief and i understand that I understand that, but I hope you see it in my heart where I was channeling energy or where I feel like I'm being placed in the actual because st I'm still in this cookie shop. I'm still in this cookie shop broad daylight. I'm still in this cookie shop broad daylight. The only thing about it is I'm not, I'm in an empty establishment. Where I see him walking out and people coming in, this feels like, um, it feels like an astral projection. I had said before that the warehouse, him being shot in the warehouse from what I was getting, for some reason, I keep interchangingly getting that in Makita's. One minute I'm in a warehouse, the next minute I'm in Makita's. But when I'm in Makita's, I'm only looking at the window. This is very important. Because I truly believe that he was like pushed. I said before, like he getting shot all up in his back. And then he being bent like this and then getting pushed. That's what I still get. I still get that. I still get him like. Thank you for that airhead. I gotta go.